so today we're gonna be taming some kamikaze or nuke dodos because there's two different types i'm gonna be using some of the tips that you guys gave me so one of the tips was to just basically run at it and it won't explode at all apparently so we're gonna try that and just see if that is gonna work hey kamikaze dodo come on oh god but well, that didn't work at all. Okay, so another tip that you guys had was to let the dodo come to you and give you a big hug. I'm pretty sure this one's legit, so we're gonna let this one happen. Look, he's coming up for a hug. He really wants a hug. Does he actually want a hug? I hope so. Oh, God! Okay, so another tip that you guys had was to approach it using Gilly. So we're gonna try this. There's one right over here. Hello, little guy. Okay, so we have to approach it and we have to put grenades in its butt. So we're gonna try that. We're getting close, we're getting close. He is steaming up, he is ready to blow. Please don't blow. Hey, buddy. Hey, how do we put the grenades in your butt? Oh, God! <laughs> okay, that one did work. Okay, so all the tips so far have not been working out. I'm feeling like you guys are not really giving me proper tips at all. So hopefully this one's gonna work because I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy about this one. So apparently if we bring a dodo to the kamikaze dodo, it will mate with it and then we get to have dodos. So let's see, they're gonna mate. Oh, he, he wants, okay, he wants me. Okay, so one of the final tips that we're gonna try, hopefully this one works, Apparently, if you bring a kamikaze dodo to your base and let it blow up in your base, it turns your whole base to tech. I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're not doing this. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't even go. I can't go on with that one. It's just so stupid. <laughs> Guys, welcome back to some more Primal Fear. Um, of course, we're just we're just playing around here. <laughs> just, I got so many like trolly comments of people being like, "Oh yeah, this is how you do this." Because I said it in the last video that you guys are gonna leave a bunch of comments like that. But luckily, I have some sort of brain power, and it's I don't know. It's, it's sometimes works. So today, I think we are actually going to start taming up some of these kamikaze dodos because I've learned that there are two types of dodos. There's the kamikaze and then there's the nuke dodo. Now, to get the nuke dodo, apparently they spawn in the wild, but they're untamable. But to get them, you need to breed kamikaze dodos and you get a random chance of getting yourself a nuke dodo. I think they're called nuke dodo, actually. Nuka dodo. That's a weird word. Um, so that's what we're going to go ahead and do here today. So first of all, what we got to do is, uh, is clean up my stuff because <laughs> I blew up my armor on purpose like several times. Oh man. And then after that, we're going to head out and actually look for some of these dodos. I do know where a good level is that I did not play around with for this little skit because obviously I don't want that creature to blow up. But guys, go ahead and hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. Really just help me out and I do appreciate it, of course. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. Oh my god, that freaking dragon is awesome looking. It's like fully white. I don't want to go near it though because it's got a lot of health. Yeah, it's fully white. Look at all its color regions. Just the exact same color. I like it though. Uh, there's also a myth boss down there. We're staying away from myth creatures. Yeah, because of what happened in the last episode. Don't really want to talk about it. It's kind of, kind of dumb. <laughs> Why did that have to happen to my little Thunderbird? We'll tame another one at some point. Don't worry. But uh, yeah, the Dodo was somewhere around here. It was like a 280, I think. Let's see. That's a regular dodo. Oh, there it is. Okay. So don't worry. I know the proper way to tame these things. Okay. I have gotten some useful comments. You got to run up to them and punch them in the face. I understand that that's how you tame them. Don't worry, guys. So let's go ahead and do this then. No. <laughs> Obviously, that's not how you do it. You got to actually knock him out. Um, okay. So he doesn't actually have that much torpor. Hopefully, that's not going to somehow kill him. Okay. So I've knocked him out. Are we good? You're not gonna like blow up on me now, are you? All right, so I brought some veggies. I think there was just one around here. I'm pretty sure. I hope it's just one. Oh, there's a little scout guy. Uh, let me see if I can kill you. No, I thought he was gonna keep flying up. Go away. Yeah, just go away. What are you doing? Ha! I can't hit him. <laughs> All right, we gotta get rid of that thing. I don't know if that's the type of scout that will shoot at you or not. Come here. Where are you? There we go. You're dead. I think it's just a regular one, but I'm kind of nervous because I'm pretty sure I had like little scout drones shooting at me before. So yeah, we don't want to mess with them. Um, at least we can actually get like a proper look at the nuke or the kamikaze dodo here. It's got like the little bone uh, skull helmet thingy on it and it's got a piece of C4 strapped to its back here. So it's basically like what dodos were 
on official servers at one point. <laughs> I don't know if that turtle's gonna be pissed at me or not. Okay, you stay right there. Stay right there, okay. We're good. Uh, so yeah, I figured I'd just tame this thing up with some uh, veggies instead of trying to make the kibble because whatever It just takes like regular normal kibble because I guess technically it is just a dodo, right? I mean, it's got some what kind of similar stats to a normal dodo. So yeah, this is gonna be awesome Now we just got to find another good level and uh, Tame it up and then we can get breeding wait. I don't know what gender the one that we got is I gotta check that Wait, did you have something? Okay. Thought he had something so this one here is a male. So we need a female. We need a lovely lady for this, for this lovely little man. He's gonna blow up on her. <laughs> so wrong. All right. So um, yeah. We, I guess we just gotta take a little look around for them. I don't know if these things do anything like once they're tamed. So I don't really want to check and see because I if it's gonna blow up, I don't want that to happen because obviously I'm gonna lose it then. So yeah. Hopefully we can keep this thing safe until um until we get a lovely lady for it all right i feel like it's just gonna need one more hey there we go nice okay i don't know what you do but i'm gonna i'm just gonna put you into the soul ball imagine if it blew up on me right there <laughs> with my armor that i have on i can survive the blast so that's good let's see um don't know if there's any more of them around here. I did come looking here, but that was the only one I found along this little stretch of uh, beach. But the way to find these things is apparently, you know, they just spawn with dodos. So they're kind of like a random chance creature. So I guess we're going to have to do a lot of looking around. Also, I do have to say they are kind of a pain to spot, like to, you know, tell the difference between them and a dodo, especially with the white outline coming from the spyglass thing. Uh, they do have sometimes kind of similar colors to each other, though. I've seen a lot of yellow. Um, okay. Gonna keep looking. Oh, there's another one, a female. Nice. I didn't see you earlier. So you must be fresh. All right, let's get over here then. Sweet. All right, and it's a 260. I'm completely happy with that. That is going to make a very good nuke. Nice. Uh, all right, let's see. There it is. Oh, that didn't hit properly. Okay. Try that again. Eh. There we go. Oh, crap. I killed it. Oh, no. I hit it with a headshot and it blew up. Oh, my God. All right. Well, at least I wasn't in the blast radius. Damn, that sucks. Ah, man, that was a 260 and everything. God damn it. All right. We got to keep looking. Oh, by the way, I killed a buffoon creature. Here, I'm going to roll the clip right now. Okay, so we don't have our little featherlight buddy anymore to kill this buffoon, but I do have my griffin, and I hope that we can take it out. It's only a level 40, so I want to see what they drop. Probably some sort of, like, a set of chainsaw or something. I would hope, at least. Nice, okay, that's good to know. It doesn't have any sort of resistance. Oh, God. <laughs> if only I could actually, like, swoop down and hit it with all this stuff in the way. Uh, let's see. Let's go over this way. All right, come on, buddy. Yeah, there we go. I got him. <laughs> oh my god. All right. We're going to hit him this time, too. Nice. I think two more hits. Okay, one more. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hey, Cobalt, you see me? Do you see me? Yeah, you should come to me. You know what? I should actually have my reusable. Oh, what's happening? Is he coming? Okay. Should have my reusable crossbow on the hotbar because that makes more sense and I, then I won't die potentially. All right, let's see. I want to check his health and just see that he's actually hurt. Okay, so I think he... No, he hasn't healed at all. I guess he has 108,000. I thought it was just 100,000. Okay, one more. Oh my God. Redwoods is an awful place to use a griffin. Yes, I got him. Oh, what do we get? Um, Here, first of all, you know what? Let me harvest him up. Okay, he doesn't give anything unique. Stupid Microraptors, come on, buddy. You want to fight, huh? There you go. Uh, so what do you give then? Oh, wow, amazing. Um, I think we got a shield, right? Oh, yeah, all this stuff popped into my inventory. Okay, so, we, oh, yeah, look. We got some amazing chainsaws. Holy crap. We killed that guy. Uh, we got pretty much everything that's on him. We got some pikes. Uh, we got a shield. Yeah, pretty much like everything that is attached to this buffoon, we get to keep. What the hell was that? What did that giant explosion thing? Just checking these dodos here. No. I know that there's primal uh, megalodons over here. What the hell blew up something? Is it that? Is that a celestial? Oh, yeah, it is. 
Ooh, okay. I'm lucky I wasn't in that blast radius. I'm not sure how powerful Celestials are. I know that they're like one of the most powerful creatures. I think Demonic are, are more powerful than them, but that's kind of scary. I'm going to go over here. That's an aloe as well, so might be a pretty nasty creature. Let's see. Yeah, look at that. Half a million health. All right, I'm going over here. I don't want to be anywhere near you. All right, great. <laughs> oh my God, what is that? Myth turtle. Holy crap, that thing looks cool. Uh, oh, this is um, this is the fifth tier boss, I do believe. Um, you need to kill him, and then he he's gonna give you like an item that will allow you to uh, ascend celestial creatures, and make them even stronger, which is gonna be kind of cool, actually. Let's see, what are these guys? No, nothing good. So obviously we're gonna fight him at some point, but not right now, because we're like nowhere near ready to fight something like that. I wonder if a Velanosaur could kind of tear through it, though. I'm curious about that. Oh my god! What on earth is that? That thing just popped in in front of me. Look at that. What? Oh my god! It's a giant turtle! What on earth? There's a Karkados beside it. Wait, let me see. Let me see. Let me get close. Is that thing... Okay. Is that thing aggressive? It's got 80 million health. That is a Scary big turtle. I don't like that. Make it go outside. I I don't... Oh, God. It's so big. Oh, no. Is it angry at me? Okay. I thought it might have been. Oh, man. That thing's giving me the chills. The thing is gigantic. That's got to be like one of the biggest myth creatures. It's definitely not. It's definitely a bigger creature. That wasn't here earlier. That was not here. What are those down there? Bunnies? I'm just trying to have a look, Mr. Giant Turtle Man. Oh god, you're scary. Like that thing is honestly terrifying. It's a giant turtle with like an artifact crown and weird like bubbly clouds around it. I don't like it. <laughs> that thing is Oh my god. That is honestly kind of scary. All right, let me I'm just looking at the dodos, man. I, I don't want I don't want any of your business. Just, you know, hanging out, looking at dodos. It's bird watching. This is my hobby. Okay, you're not gonna attack me. I don't think that it will. From what I know, like the majority of the myth creatures are just passive, which is kind of weird when you think about it. But I guess it also means that I can actually have it in the world without it hunting me down and, and destroying me. But like, why? Why is that thing so big? Why is it just hanging out on the beach? And why does it freaking deload like that? That is terrifying. Could you imagine if I was running through on something that did like passive damage to things around it? I would go right into that thing and it would just kill me instantly because it's got 80 million health. There's no way I could kill it. And we got Megalodons everywhere. This is terrifying. We should put you over there and you fight that giant turtle. That thing was ridiculously cool looking, but also gigantic and terrifying. And oh God, it's a big pego along with a little pego. I'm going over here. I've been looking for an alpha Velanosaur or something like that. Maybe even an apex, whichever one exists. I mean, I don't know which one is a thing, but uh, haven't been able to find anything. I'm really hoping to get one because that would be really cool. Um, oh man, wait, is that a dodo? No, that is a little scout dude. Oh, here's a, some dodos. Let's say, oh, there's a kamikaze one right there. What are you? You're a normal dodo and you're a toxic? Yeah, probably. Couldn't even spyglass it. All right, so let's not hit this one in the head if we can. Um, let's try and hit him in the body. Okay, there he is. Is he out? Okay, he's out. We're good. We are golden. All right. You know what, Mr. Toxic Dodo? Maybe you just die real quick and we'll be good. There we go. All right, so let's see. Let's drop in a bunch of veg. How much is it gonna take? Roughly like nine veg. There we go, sweet. Nice, so I'm gonna put you away very carefully. There we go. We're all good. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna get the hell out of here and get back to base, start the breeding process, and just start making little nukes. Hopefully the other countries don't come after me. Oh, actually, I just had a thought. Um, I know that the Genesis expansion for Primal Fear is actually... I, I think it's almost done, or else it's, like, coming very soon. I really don't know. I know that it's coming. Um, 
So that's going to be pretty cool to check out because it's going to have like all of the Genesis creatures, probably even some of the stuff that we weren't able to tame as well, like the little bugs and stuff like that. I really don't know what's in the update, but I imagine it's probably going to have some of that cool stuff. Either way, I'm very excited for it because I can't wait to get myself a gigantic, terrifying Ferox because you know that there's going to be something like that. You just know. All right, let's see if I clone this griffin. There we go. Nice. I want to harvest you up. Give me your feathers. There we go. So yeah, I'm pretty excited for that whenever that's coming out. Hopefully it's coming out soon though. All right, so we got a bunch of stuff here, but we also got our dodos. Let's check them out. Uh, where are they? There they are. <laughs> All right, come here, buddy. There you go. Please don't blow up. You know what? I don't trust these things. I'm putting them over here. <laughs> I really like, I just don't trust them. I feel like something like maybe the baby would blow up or something if I killed it. It might. Oh, God. I shouldn't hatch the eggs near these guys at all. All right. They are fuming. They are ready. Let's get you going. There you go. All right. I really hope there's no way to, like, trigger the explosion or something because that would be awful. But, uh, yeah, these guys look terrifying. Look at you. Little terrifying freaking skull helmets. You mean business, don't you? I can tell. All right. So... Just got to get these things to start breeding for a bit then. Uh, are they actually breeding? They are. Yes, sweet. All right, so I know I have a hatchery, so I'll set that up, and we'll get going with some eggs and stuff. Hopefully, we can manage to get ourselves some, uh, what are they called? The nuke dodos. All right, let's just pop down the hatchery here. That's fine. And I'm going to need some refertilizer. Oh, by the way, I want to address this rifle because I've been getting so many comments about it, like... I just want you to know that I know that this is a thing and I do plan on making it, but I can't make it right now. Look how expensive it is. So yeah, I mean like look at that cementing paste, 13,000. I don't have that much. I mean, I could probably try to grind out this stuff and I plan to do it eventually, but not right now. I'm, I'm good with the trank rifles and everything, okay? So just wanted to let you guys know, I do know it's a thing and don't worry about it. All right, so I've got quite a few eggs now. Let's see, we got, what is that, 14? Let's grab them all real quick. So hopefully we have some nuke dodos out of this. I don't know how rare they actually are, but I'm really hoping that we get some. Let's see. And I'm also kind of curious, like once I have one, can I breed them? Is that a thing? I hope so. All right, so let's go ahead and disable wandering on you and just put you there. Okay, I'm really hoping that these things don't blow up. So better not happen. You better not explode on me, I swear. All right, there we go. So far, just kamikazes. That's okay, though. So I hatched up all of the dodos, and uh, none of them are... Oh, my God, we have a lot of eggs in here. Holy crap. Yeah, that is insane. Um, one thing that we could do is potentially just take away the hatchery, and um, instead we could just use this soul terminal to just pick them up, and then just... I could AFK for, like, a little bit or something and, and come back, and eventually, you know, we might have some nuke dodos. I really don't know. I kind of want some today. I just want to see if I could breed them and stuff like that, so... We might do that. We might do that. But for the moment, we've got, like, what? Is like, 16 dodos here? Something like that. So we could probably take these little guys and maybe imprint them. Or should I even bother? I mean, I don't know. I could probably make a nanny and imprint them that way. Okay, so it's been a little bit, and I have one nuke dodo and a ton of kamikaze dodos. Uh, let me just type in. There we go. That should probably pull all of them. Sweet. Okay, yeah, I don't know how many that is. That's a lot, though. And then our nuke one, let's put that on the hotbar. I don't know if these things look any different, so we're going to have to check and see. All right, let me chuck you down, like, over here. Oh, that thing is fully grown already. Wait, what? Oh. Wait, what? Does that thing, like, imprint them now? Okay, that's kind of confusing. What is the difference here? Is this... Oh, wait. Okay, never mind. You have two pieces of C4. These ones only have one? Is that the difference? Are you serious? I thought it would be, like, super cool looking or something like that. All right, well... Yeah, apparently that's it. That's cool. Um, we're gonna need more uh, nuke dodos, obviously, to breed them. I assume they can breed. So for the moment, we're gonna put you away. Wait, where's my little? There. Okay, wait. No, I gotta go like this. Okay. Yeah. Great. Uh, let's put you right here. Boom. All right. So we should have a crap ton of dodos here that we could chuck out. Um, and I feel like using them on something. So. 
yeah let's let's just take an army of these dodos with us and we'll find something big to like go attack and we'll just destroy whatever that is okay i think that's like five yeah i dropped out five of them so let's send those guys in on this bracky they're gonna probably hit that dodic or get hit by the dodic and then die and they're gonna blow up there we go they didn't kill anything great <laughs> or did they no i don't think they actually did I don't think they killed anything. Great. All right. Well, let's try that again. What type of Carno are you? You're just uh, an Alpha Carno, although not the vanilla type. Um, okay. There's a giant Hesperornis there. All right. You know what? Let me drop out a bunch of my dudes right here. And then that way they're going to be like right beside the Brackies. And we can just send them straight in. Okay. Let's send in like three of them for the moment. Okay. Let me back up. All right. Oh my. Oh no. What? Something attacked them. No. Oh crap. Oh no. Something just attacked them as soon as I hopped onto the griffin. Okay. Well, that's not good. Luckily, we're right beside where the griffin is, so it might not die. I don't know what attacked though. Oh, little griffin, you better be okay. Cobalt. I swear, man. What are you? Okay. I don't know what happened. <laughs> All of my armor just got destroyed. Besides my helmet, which we should be hiding, to be honest. There we go. Uh, I feel like it might have been that Carno. That's probably what attacked. Cobalt, come here. Oh my god. Well, are you okay? Like, you didn't take that much damage. Alright, we're good, we're good. Um, so that didn't work out very well. I guess we should probably stay at a further distance. Instead, maybe what we could just do is just be on the back of the griffin and then send in the dodos. All right, this could work. Come on, destroy that bracky. Any second now. There we go. Oh my god, it's a big explosion. Um, that didn't seem to hurt it, though. Uh, or maybe it did? I, I don't know. Let me just start throwing in a bunch of dodos. <laughs> I can't even see. There we go. Come on, get in there and, and do some stuff. Explode, kill things. Oh, wow. I, I got hurt from... Oh, no, it's a bug. Okay. Did that... That didn't even work. Are these dodos even exploding on the creatures and hurting them? Like, what's happening here? All right, well, we gotta keep trying. I mean... All right, let's just, like, be super high up like this and then... Just, you know, start attacking something. I don't know. Just attack something. Where is that dodo? I can't see right now. Let's see, come on. Start attacking these guys. There you go. All right. Come on, blow up and destroy things. All right, we got to try out some smaller creatures. Oh, wait, no, I think that worked. I think that Bracky just died. Yeah, well, we killed a Bracky. Amazing. Did we get one okay i think just one dodo blew up or something i really don't know oh there's there goes the other one so i could i just couldn't see them from here obviously all right let's see let's send these brack or these brackies these dodos in on that bracky right there so we are killing things it's just not showing any like damage numbers or anything nice did we kill that guy let's see He's almost... No, he's not. He's got... They've, they've got tons of health. Let's go fight something else. I wonder how, how much better the nuke ones are, actually. Kind of curious about that. Like, are they going to be insane compared to these kamikaze ones? Because kamikaze ones are pretty decent, to be honest. I mean, they keep almost killing me, so that's probably a good sign. All right, let's see. Go fight uh, this Straco, whatever they're called. Get over there. All right, you know what? Fight that one. There you go. Boom. Did you kill anything? Wait, I had my thing out already. Okay. Let's just let the dust settle. For the moment, though, let's check out another one. Okay, yeah. All right, so the dodo did kill things. It just doesn't pop up with anything, though, unfortunately. Uh, does, like, just whistling them on do anything, or do they actually have to take damage? I feel like they do. No, there we go. So it's kind of... Oh, God, what the hell did I just do? All right. Um, it's kind of weird. You don't actually get any pop-ups for, like, getting the kill. It's kind of odd. I really expected us to actually get some pop-ups, but 
Yeah, we don't. Um, okay, is there anything worth actually going at? Okay, well, we gotta watch out for the myth creatures. I don't want to mess with something big like that. Um, is there, like, something worth fighting, though? I could just, like, drop them in on top of, like, these creatures fighting. That could actually be kind of funny. All right, let's try this. Uh, boom. <laughs> we'll just let them blow up. Boom! <laughs> All right, what did we kill? Did we kill everything? Yeah, everything's dead. Nice. Amazing. So yeah, they're, they're pretty cool. They're pretty cool. I, I figured that it would be a little bit more epic, though. Unfortunately, it's not. Um, they don't do an insane amount of damage as well, so that kind of sucks. But I don't know. Maybe the nuke one, it has two pieces of C4, so maybe it does, like, double the damage or maybe even more. I, I really don't know. I guess we'll have to find out, though. But I've got a lot of... Uh, of these kamikaze dodos so i feel like maybe sending them in on something i don't really know what though i guess i could just send them in on like a is what is that like a fabled bracky yeah let's send them all in onto that bracky but we're gonna have to figure out a good place to have them first so let's just uh yeah let's be like right here and i'm gonna chuck out all of these dodos and then we're gonna we're gonna send them all in on the bracky they're just floating in the sky right now but that's okay Oh, God. Oh, something happened. Oh, my God. <laughs> I don't know how many are left. I feel like... Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, you know what? That's a bad idea. <laughs> Look at that giant cloud of smoke and dust. Okay, yeah. that That's not a good idea doing it that way. It's really not. Like, I think a raptor attacked, but something attacked before that. I don't know what it was. Come on, Pteranodon. Stop moving away. Wait, we could actually, like, shoot one of them and get them to explode. Ah, uh, here we go. Here we go. It's gonna happen. Boom! Oh, my God. <laughs> that was awesome. Let's see. Is this Pteranodon dead? Yes! That is how you kill Pteranodons the, the cool way. You know what? Screw this. I'm gonna use... No, I don't have any gas. Never mind. I was about to say I'm gonna use my chainsaw to hack this thing up. Okay, so I have another nuke dodo. I decided to just chuck out a couple more females here just so we can get a crap ton of uh, eggs going all at once and we're just gonna pick up all these guys because now we've got nuke dodos let's see all right so check you out and then is this the male yeah sweet all right so yeah it has two pieces of c4 as opposed to one uh let's quickly hitch these guys oh don't want to okay <laughs> i'm getting a little bit afraid i just i don't know how it works maybe if i punch it it might explode so i just got to be very cautious around these dudes um i guess i could test that out after but for the moment let's yeah they can breed let's get some uh eggs going and then we'll have a little army of nuke dodos to throw at things and maybe they'll be good i don't know we'll see so this is unexpected but the nuke dodos don't seem to always drop a nuke baby because I haven't gotten a single one. Hmm, did not expect that one. So I guess we're not going to have an army of nuke ones. But maybe what I'll do is I'll just send these guys in. I guess maybe I could clone them at some point. That could work. I don't know. Hmm. So I think a good way of getting a crap ton of them would be to just breed tons and tons of females with one male. So you know what? Let's do that. Let's, let's just ball up these two for the moment because... I don't really want them uh, just sitting out there breeding. And also, I don't know if they can actually breed with the kamikaze ones. So I think we're just going to chuck them in here for the moment. And let's just take out some kamikaze ones. So I decided to set up a little chain reaction of dodos here because I have tons of them. Let's go ahead and do this. Oh, wait. Oh, I didn't go that far. Damn it. Okay, I left too much space between them. Let's start here then. Did it work? I think. I don't... Yeah, it kind of did. Look, there's... There's... Yeah, it definitely worked. I just don't know how well it worked. Anyway, we have some nuke dodos, and we're going to send them in on some of these. That's a kamikaze right there. We're going to send them in on that bracky, maybe. So, first of all, let's just... Uh, let's get some, somewhat close enough, I guess. Uh, I don't really know. You know what? Screw this, because I feel like we're just going to lose our armor, so I'm just going to take it off. I'm going to send this dodo in on that big old bracky, the fabled bracky. All right. Let's see. All right. How big is this explosion going to be? Oh, my God. Oh, dude, that did 50,000. Are you kidding me? Wow. 
You d it didn't blow up my base now, did it? Okay, we're still good. We're still good. That was kind of insane. That did 50,000 damage, basically. Okay, yeah. That's, uh, that's, that's pretty good. What is that, alpha? Eh, never mind. I got tons of those. What is this in my, or in my hand, even? Um, you know what? I'm just gonna throw it out anyway. Whatever it is, it's going in. It's a nuke. Send it in on this bracky. Because then we'll actually get the kill. You know what? Let me, let me bring you a little bit closer. Wait, what the hell is that on your front there? What is that? What is, why is that red? Hmm. Okay. Let's get a little closer. Oh god. Oh no no no. No, that's a bad idea. I'm not I'm not sending it in if there's myth creatures around. Screw that. I don't want those things potentially coming after me, so I guess we're gonna find something else to to throw it at. You know what? Maybe we could send it in on this little myth guy. Cause he's not as powerful. No no, you're going in go in and fight this guy. No, no 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 no. This. This thing. Fight this. I can't even whistle it. All right, you know what? You know what? I'm just going to shoot it when it's close. All right, I'm going to actually get a decent distance away just in case. All right, let's see. That should be good. Oh, my God. Oh, dude. That I feel like that blast radius was way bigger. Oh, my God. I wonder, is that thing dead? <laughs> Holy crap. I didn't think that would actually kill me from that distance. Damn, dude. All right, let's see. Did it kill that thing? What? What? Okay, it must have been damaged in some way because there's no way that it didn't take any damage from that. I mean, that freaking nuke just like set off and, and destroyed me and I wasn't even near it. I mean, I guess I was kind of maybe too close. Ah, shut up. <laughs> All right, let's see. We've got uh, two more nukes here. We definitely got to use up the two of them. I have uh, two spare, by the way, inside of my base, and I think at some point we'll probably go ahead and, um... Oh, hello. What are you? Oh, you're, you're big old mini. I'm gonna stay over here. Uh, we're gonna probably go ahead and, and maybe, like, clone up some, some nuke dodos, but we're gonna have to wait a little bit for that, because obviously I, I don't have any cloning things. All right, go in and, and attack that bracky. Ooh, okay. Don't want to be too close. All right, here we go. This is it gonna kill everything okay you know what let me just stay away from the mushroom cloud that might actually erupt okay here we go it should kill that bracky boom oh my god it did 80,000 okay so it must do a different amount uh depending on the the way that it hits or whatever I don't know that's awesome though that is seriously cool all right you know what should we should we destroy this one you know what? No. Let's find like a big cluster of creatures and then throw it. Is this good enough? There's a celestial aloe there. Oh. oh okay. Uh, should we just send it in on that aloe? I mean, we could. We could do that. Could be a thing. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, that was the nuke. Okay, that's good. All right, go fight. Oh my god. Oh, okay. That did a crap ton of damage. Let me see. Can I? Oh, no, that was a bad idea. No. Can I? I can't move. What is happening? This was a bad idea. What did, what just happened? Okay, I was thinking maybe we could swoop down and maybe fight it, but no. It almost killed my griffin. <laughs> that was a terrible idea. Why did I do that? Oh my god. How dare. Okay, never mind. Uh <laughs> Oh, we're gonna need to we're gonna need to get some healy potions or something um oh man I kind of want to kill that Omega aloe there actually or origin or whatever it was called I don't know I think it was an Omega okay come on give me some like healy potions or something I don't think they give any of those do they no <laughs> holy crap though that aloe just obliterated my health okay I do want to kill that Omega one. We might be able to. I'm just going to have to watch out for the Celestial. It's over there, I think. There we go. Oh, no. that That's not it. Okay, yeah. There we go. Now it's dead. All right. You know what? I'm just going to harvest you up and get the hell out of here because I don't want to be anywhere near that freaking Celestial. Oh, God. What the hell is that? Mega Indom. Okay. Okay. That is cool looking interesting that is very cool 
All right, so we're gonna go back to base. Um, guys, I, I'd say that's probably the end of this episode. It's been a wild ride. Oh my God, I hope you guys have enjoyed it though. Um, I can't believe we almost killed our freaking griffin, man. We don't have any creatures left. We can't lose it. <sighs> but anyway, yeah, if you guys have enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you guys want to see more like this as well, go ahead and subscribe and uh, check out the patron server. It's, it's going really well, actually. It's, surprisingly well and uh yeah catch you in the next one look at my nipples yeah you can't keep your eyes off them can you